Hey guys, I'm Elegant and Chew, and it's finally time to take on the Pokemon League. So off screen, as I promised, I went through Victory Road and just got a bunch of items. All the items I can find, hopefully I have like enough max revives and stuff because you can't buy those things. Uh, so I've tried to find as much as I could. I found a few TMs, but they weren't really useful, like Dragon Claw, not my team could learn it, unfortunately. Uh, so that does kind of suck. I also maxed out all my uh, potions and revives and, you know, all that sort of stuff that you usually do. And I have no money left, so that was brilliant. Um, and I also have stacked up on a bunch of like drugs like Corboses and um, rare candies, so I spammed all them on my team. I only had like three rare candies, but I gave them two of them to Porkchop, because Porkchop's actually going to have a hard time with the Elite Four, because I need to use Porkchop for two, um, two Elite Four members all on its own, so that's going to be brilliant, <laughs> of course. So how it's going to work, because of course this is the Tenral Challenge, and this is the final frontier, it's my last area. Uh, which will make me win or lose, but uh, all all of the Elite Four, for the whole way through, there's going to be two rules, uh, so that's Faithful Mode and 10 minutes for each trainer, so I have to do a speedrun in 10 minutes for each trainer, and then each trainer is going to have, or at least of the each four Elite Four members are going to have their own individual um, additional rules. I don't think N and gets this, really. They don't count. Um, it's just each of the individual actual Elite Four members get their own different rules, which I'll go over once I go through those, so we're going to be stepping in into the uh, into the no going back zone and this is it. We're locked in. <laughs> we are locked in. Now, so first of all, I'm actually going to go for Marshall and I, everyone else goes for who is it? I think it's yeah, I think it's Chantel on the uh, left. I don't know why, but the first ever time I played Pokemon Black, and just every time since, I've always gone into Marshall first. I don't know why. I mean, anti-clockwise dyslexia, whatever. Because <laughs> sometimes dyslexia is like compared to doing things backwards or whatever. But yeah, I, I go in backwards way just because I'm like normal. Uh, so the rules for Marshall are uh, Monotype Electric and Disable, so I can choose what Disable move I can use. Um, so basically, my, each of my two Pokemon I can use because I have two Electric type Pokemon. I can only use one move, so Nibbles, um, probably gonna, just going to go for the Thunderbolt, possibly. Uh, I can't even remember what Pokemon Marshall has, but I can use a Striker and Nibbles. Yes, yeah, so... Let's hope we can do this. I actually spent like, almost an hour, so sad, but I know, uh, but trying to prepare for the... Oh, let me just get my timer set and ready. Uh, so I'll start my timer now. And yeah, I spent almost an hour trying to go through all the individual moves and all the members of the Elite Four. And I was like, it just didn't work because I didn't have all the TMs I could get. and. Really, I don't have that many TMs, and so I was just like, screw it, I'm gonna go, and just go for it. So Thunderbolt is gonna be the move for Nibbles, just because it's got the additional bonus of possibly being able to paralyze your opponents, uh, which is definitely useful. Oh, crap. Oh, absolute crap. Oh, no. Oh, <laughs> no. We can't fail this right, no. Come on, why is the friggin... We have, we have to do this. I'm, I'm pretty sure Stone Hedge is like 80 accuracy, so it hopefully might miss. Oh... Uh, thrash? Yeah, we're gonna have to go for Thrash. Uh, just because it's a pretty strong move. <laughs> Damn! Uh, hopefully we're still faster, though. Else... Oh, frick. Of course. Oh, we can heal. I completely just didn't think about that because I'm, I'm, I'm crazy, of course. Um, so, uh, I don't know what to do here because it sort of got me in a trap, and uh, I don't, I don't think full restore heals your confusion, does it? Could, could it do? I mean, it has status problems, and is confusion classed as a status problem? No, it isn't because it's also classed. Um, well, it's, it doesn't, it, it can be had, you can be confused with a status problem, so, ah, damn. Oh, payback. Okay, so you're not stuck to using the move that's super effective against me. That is good. 
Although I'm sort of getting the feeling that if you do use Bulldoze now, I'm screwed. So I'm going to use a Max Potion on Nibbles, just because I want to switch out. Oh god, don't take me out. Oh! Did he get a critical hit or something before? He must have done. Oh, this isn't that bad then. I can just max potion myself right now, and then I should be good to take him out in like two turns with the thrash, possibly. Uh, but I'm stuck in using thrash now because I can't use version any other move because I'm so damn clever. I guess, um. Oh, you know what? You know what? I'm gonna switch because I'm gonna be too slow now and you might just get a random crit, of course. Uh, so, two minutes in. I, I, he has four Pokemon. I don't know what he's with Pokemon. I think he has a Sork, um, a Scrafty. That might have been a good idea to think about that. I probably should have used a Bug type move. I totally didn't think about it. The Rocky Helmet's definitely helping out here. Uh, so, I mean, because we have Signal Beam on Nibbles, so therefore Scrafty would have been weak to that, which would have just been a good idea to use against it. But no, just Thunderbolt, you know. Uh, Okay, we're faster. Or unless it's, you're gonna use a full freaking res. <laughs> you. You ass, Marshall. You. How many full restores? I think they only have two. So I think he's just gone and wasted his full restores on his uh, throw here. The most annoying freaking Pokemon ever. I'm gonna use up all my full restores. I'm gonna max potions, sorry, on this one battle. And this is. This is one of the easiest ones. Oh, God. Why is it hitting you every time with Stone Edge? I'm... I'm seriously confused now. I'm going to switch back into White Stripe. At least, I mean, uh, the speed boost will have, um... The speed decrease will have gone now. But, uh... Now he, now he misses! You absolute freaking retard. Thanks. Thanks. Kick you in the face. You deserve that. Don't you dare get a crit. Now, take him out. Kill him. <laughs> Thank God we got rid of that guy. Uh, so, I think we can switch now because uh, we're not locked into Thrash anymore. Which is a good thing. It's a sock. Do I think... You better not also have Stone Edge and hit every freaking time. If you dare. If you do, we're actually halfway through. The time <laughs> beating this first Pokemon. So I'm going to use a Max Potion because I'm scared and he better not use. Why would you have two Pokemon with Stone Edge? I don't. Freaking. I'm seriously joking right now. You are joking. <laughs> I'm just going to keep spamming it and hoping it misses at some point. And then, and then potioning up my Zip Striker so I can switch. What? Why are you hitting so much? If you tag it. <laughs> Going well. I think we should get into a positive mindset. So that, I, I use my Hyper Potions instead just because, uh, I don't know. I, I think, I don't think anyone's any higher than 200 HP. I have potions with four heals anyway. How are you? <laughs> freaking hacks. Marshall, you are freaking hacking. This is, this is the easiest, this is the easiest one, I think. I know, um, no, this is the easiest one. This is the easiest one. <laughs> and I'm struggling like hell. Joyous. How much PP does that freaking move have? <laughs> Six minutes into the timer. Oh, this sucks so bad. I just want to be able to switch, but I don't. I can't switch because. Oh! Oh, here we go! Here's our opportunity. Ah. And thinking. Okay, another. Another. Stone Edge shouldn't take us out. But he might be out of Stone Edges anyway, so I'm just gonna max up um, Substract and Switch. Oh, okay, you must be out of. Possibly? 
you were out of um, the uh, thingy magic of the Stone Age, so I will just max potion nibbles and stay in actually, if you're out of it, which thank god. And I've realised that they have Stone Age now because of flying type Pokemon, and the, because that's the weakness, and so they would have rock type moves to counteract that. Uh, so just Thunderbolt, and hopefully the rest of the team won't just just screw me over with three random super effective moves that they shouldn't have. And of course, lives with one HP. Thank God to my rocky helmet. I did not think about that. I just sort of went in. I was like, gonna go for this, and somehow, somehow I get the feeling this freaking thing has a uh, possibly has Stone Age. So I'm just gonna go for high conversion just to be safe. I, I can't risk it. I need to. You're joking me. You're seriously joking me right now. And you're probably gonna have like Earthquake and <laughs> freaking some. Why? You cheap. You absolute cheap person, Marshall. How. I'm... I don't even know what to say to this guy. He can't friggin' show Stone Edge onto every single one of his Pokemon. That is just un. Oh my god! We're stuck! No, we're stuck! We're stuck into it! We're stuck! We're stuck! We're stuck! Weak! White Stripe! Crap! And I've just remembered. We can't even use revives the whole way through. I was thinking, yeah, use revives between each of them, but we can't. Because. I can't use revives because, because of freaking fatal mode. I I just absolutely messed this up. Oh god. Right, okay, we need to do this and quick. So Thunderbolt, go, 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 go. We're in the last minute. We're in the last minute. Come on, we we need to do this. Next. Pokemon, come on. No, we don't want to level up. We just want a next Pokemon. Um, Man Shao, come on. Half a minute left. <laughs> just spam it. I, oh, I don't care, it's your eyes. Just die. Freaking die, Man Shao. You better not have Stone Age if you do. Oh, Rock Slide. Even better. In fact, I don't think it does as much damage, so. <gasps> have we done it? Just. Freaking. Marshall! With five seconds to go. With five seconds to go. That was intense. And coming to the realization that I can't even heal my Pokemon. Like, revive my Pokemon. Oh my god. So, Z Striker's down and out. Oh god. Oh crap. White Stripe. I completely just disregarded the fact of uh, fatal molders. Oh no! <laughs> right, so we passed that. That's well, we passed the first um, first member. That's all that matters. But the easiest one was losing a Pokemon. Five seconds left. Oh god, I'm, I'm gonna do this. So yeah, thank you for watching. Hopefully we can do this. <laughs> that was a close one. So yeah, I'll see you next time.